ஹாய் இஸ்லாம் வலைக்கும் டுடே ஆம் பேக் வித் அன் அதர் டேஸ்டி ரெசிபி திஸ் இஸ் பனீர் பூர்ஜி திஸ் இஸ் ஒன் ஆஃப் த எம்மி டிஷ் விச் யூ கேன் மேக் வித் பனீர் த ஃபஸ்ட் ஸ்டெப் இஸ் டு மேக் சம் ஹோம் மேட் பனீர் ஃபார் திஸ் இன்ஸ்டெட் ஆஃப் யூசிங் மில்க் ஐம் கோயிங் டு யூஸ் ஹியர் சம் மில்க் பவுடர் த ரீசன் ஃபார் யூசிங் மில்க் பவுடர் ஃபார் ப்ரிப்பேரிங் மில்க் இஸ் தேட் த ஃபேட் கண்டென்ட் இன் திஸ் மில்க் இஸ் ஹை கம்பேர் டு த நார்மல் மில்க் திஸ் இஸ் வாட் ஐ ஃபெல் So I'm going to prepare here milk using milk powder as per the instruction in the packet. I think I have made this a bit complicated but it's simple. Just going to use the instruction here and uh, add the milk powder equivalent to that adding the water. So I have prepared here 1 liter of milk. Rest all the steps are same that's boiling the milk. In between keeping a strainer ready with a muslin cloth. Once the milk starts boiling, adding vinegar or lemon juice. Another difference what I personally felt is that the amount of vinegar for uh, adding to this milk is also higher compared to the normal milk. Now, after straining, we also have to just rinse this with normal water. While the paneer is resting let's move to the preparation of the gravy for that we'll be using half an onion few ginger garlic then uh, two tomatoes then one uh, chili this is a uh, bhaji chili have removed the seeds and also half a capsicum on to a pan add 1 tablespoon of pure ghee you can also use butter next to this add quarter teaspoon of cumin seeds followed by the chopped ingredients while the onion and other ingredients are getting sauteed i'm preparing here chapati dough on to 2 cups of whole wheat flour i have seasoned the flour with salt for kneading instead of using water i have used the paneer water this is highly nutritious in stuff throwing you can also use it in such a way you can also make uh, drinks out of this so this is slightly warm now knead well and allow the dough to rest for at least 1 hour season the onions with salt 1 and 1/2 teaspoons of kashmiri red chili powder quarter teaspoon of garam masala then around half teaspoon of chaat masala and roast well now it's time to add two tomatoes chopped cover and cook until the tomatoes turns mashy Now it's time to add our homemade paneer. Slightly break with your hands and add. Now mix this very well. Now for an extra taste, add some chopped coriander leaves. Then around one teaspoon of kasuri methi. Now to make this more tasty and rich, next season with some pepper powder and finally around 3 to 4 tablespoons of fresh cream and give this a good mix. After adding the fresh cream, you can decide the consistency of your burji. If you want to make it more loose, you can add few tablespoons of milk. Never add water, but for me this is the perfect texture to enjoy with chapati. After adding the fresh cream I have just cooked for 2 minutes more. Now this is perfectly ready to enjoy with some hot chapati. So let me prepare the chapati quickly. Now 
If you wish, you can spread some pure ghee on top of the chapati to make it more tasty. But for me, I'm going to serve it as it is with some onion rings. So hope you have enjoyed today's dish. Do try this out and then serve to your loved ones. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.